All right, so we're going to be doing one of the more iconic NBA quiz videos where we're going to try to name the top 25 all time in these eight categories. Oh, yeah, we're going to have games, points, rebounds, assists, blocks, steals, three point field goals, and free throw percentage. So, like always, I will leave a link to the quiz in the description below. If you want to pause the video now, take the quiz and see if you get a better score than me. And if you guys do enjoy the quiz videos, feel free to drop a thumbs up. We got 200 repeatable names. Like, there's not going to be 200 different names here because there'll be guys in multiple category lists. And we have 15 minutes to do so. Now I did do this quiz probably a year and a half ago and some of it has changed in my opinion and it's like the third highest played NBA quiz ever at 1.3 million plays. So yeah let's just start this and get into this. So like games played um, is like Robert Parrish up there. Yep. All time games played a 16, 11. That's insane. He's also there in rebounds and blocks. I mean we could do Jordan out of the way. He's only there in points and steals which is kind of shocking i honestly thought maybe he'd be in some other spots but you know i guess that makes sense um lebron is in games points assist steals and three-point field goals speaking of three-point field goals let's do steph who's now the all-time leader in free throw percentage which is kind of crazy i know steve nash will be up there as well um he's right behind him is jason kidd in there he's not but he's in a bunch of other things let's do kobe let's do Shaq, who's in points rebounds blocks um, as well and let's do do Akeem we can do a lot of the bigs so Akeem's yeah all-time blocks leader let's do Wilt um, who's up there in points and rebounds we know Carmelo's up there in points and Kareem um, Abdul-Jabbar he's gonna be up there in points as well also second all-time in games because we know that LeBron is now the all-time scoring leader all-time assist leader at 15,806 that is John Stockton and he's also there in games and the all-time steals leader as well yeah truly one of the better point guards in NBA history let's do my, um, Isaiah Thomas and another goat point guard maybe you think he is the best all-time better than Steph still and that's Magic Johnson who has assists uh, or we get George Johnson for blocks, which is kind of nice because I don't think I was going to get him. Um, we also get Magic Johnson for steals and Joe Johnson for three point field goals. I know like Harden's going to be there for three point field goals and Damian Willard might be there as well. Yeah, like he's high. It's like Tracy McGrady now. No, he's not there. Well, Ray Allen, um, he's up there in games as well and free throw percentage. I know like, hmm, let's, let's go back to some of the bigs. I know I didn't do Bill Russell. See here, uh, he is second all time in rebounds. That's it though. 21,620. Is Kevin McHale here? He is not for anything. Uh, Tim Duncan is there for games, points, rebounds, and blocks. David Robinson is there for games and blocks. Is Dwight Howard on any of these? He is for rebounds and blocks as well. Damn, I don't think Yao Ming would have made anything specifically. Uh, if we want to think point guards, like what about Terry Porter? Uh, good passing point guard. Doc Rivers here? No. Uh, okay, Rajon Rondo? He is there. Uh, I said Jason Kidd. Let me just type in Williams. So we get Buck Williams. Darren Williams was the guy I was kind of going for. Sydney Moncrief, uh, Moncrief for any of these. I don't think Giannis would be anything just yet. No, he's got a ways away. Kawhi hasn't played enough. Um, Dwayne Wade, he is on none of these. Did I try Melo? I didn't. He is up there in points. I know Dirk will be as well. Um, he's also fourth all time in games. And then he is top 10 there in points also. No, Paul Pierce will be here. Um, I know KG will be here. There we go. Will Joakim Noah be on any of these defensive? No. What about the Gasols? So we get Pal Gasol for blocks. So we're doing well on games. Could be doing better on points. So like Harden is there. I would love if like there was like a team that would make it a little bit easier. It's pretty tough without the team. So you're kind of just thinking of goats specifically like Mitch Richmond. Is he on anything? No. Is Alonzo Mourning on anything? He probably should be at least yeah for blocks. Like what about Penny Hardaway? No. Or Tim Hardaway for assist. There you go. Um, what about Chris Mullen? Nope um yeah nothing for chris mullen what about bill walton for blocks no mark eden for blocks there we go I'm surprised bill walton isn't anything there on time what about like adrian danley if we want to go like team by team go it's like patrick ewing there's another good center that i didn't mention uh walt frazier for assists no not there i don't know if there's any point guards like in the last ten oh chris ball duh let me get chris ball who's third all time in assists and third all time in steals as well uh, we could kind of go by team by team if there's any other Knicks. It's like Bill Bradley on any of these. Um, Sean Bradley for blocks. Uh, what about Bill uh, Daughtery? Um, no. Um, okay. What about Knicks, Nets? Like, I don't think Brooke Lopez would be there. Gil, no. Coleman. What about Petrovich? Uh, no. Uh, Vince Carter. There we go. Let me get Vince for some of these. Okay, yeah. Third all-time in games. He's points leader as well as three-point field goals. Grand Hill for anything? No um if i wanted to say 
any Raptor goats? Chris Bosh for any of these? No, I said Vince Carter and I said Tracy McGrady. I don't think Kyle Lowry. Oh, Kyle Lowry is there for three-point field goals and assists. Calderon for assists? No, right? Okay, no Calderon. Damien Stoudemire now. What about, or even Amari Stoudemire? What about uh, Mike Conley? Is he there in assists? No. Mike Bibby? No. Uh, stage, uh, Peja Stoy Akovic? Three-point field goals there. Oh, he's there for free throw percentage, but not three-point field goals. Is Buddy Heald there in three-point field goals? No. <laughs> that would be kind of crazy if he was. Uh, let's see. It's like Derek Fisher. <laughs> he's there for games. I was going to say like randomly three-point field goals. I could think for more Lakers like Elgin Baylor. I know he's not a Laker, but George Urban. Okay. What about like James Worthy? Is he there for anything? No. Uh, any Laker specific? Not Bynum. Anthony Davis here for anything yet? No. Um, I'm just kind of maybe. Oh, I didn't type in Kevin Durant's name. There we go. For points, three-point field goals, and free throw percentage. Well, let's do Klay Thompson. Don't think like we'll get Tremont Green. Uh, anybody like Kyrie Irving? Is he there? He is. Um, what about Jimmy Butler? Now he had a slow start to his career. Paul George there at all? Yep, he's there for three point field goals. What about Gordon Hayward? What about John Wall for assists? No. Beal for three point field goals? No. Okay. Uh, Tony Parker for assists. There we go. Um, he is there. I'm not doing as good as I was hoping so far. I feel like there's probably a bunch of Celtics that I'm forgetting, like Danny Ainge for steals. Um, have let check. There we go. What about Pete Maravich? Is he on any of these? Nope. Um, what about Dave Bing? Um, Bill Wainer? No. I'm trying to think. Like Pistons. Dumars? He's no. Dumars is not on anything. Drummond for rebounds? That would have been crazy. Uh, because Patrick Ewing is there. Tyson Chandler? No. Okay. Struggling. Sean Marion for steals? There we go. There's Sean Marion making that list. I. Well, I think that could be Stoudemire. No, he's not there. Hmm. All right, trying to think who some of these guys could be. Kind of going back to the, trying to go back to uh, the Lakers, Suns, like, what about Chambers? No. Uh, what about, oh, Gary Payton, let's do the glove. There we go. Sean Kemp for anything. Jack Sigma, no. Uh, what about Bob Pettit? There we go. What about Jerry West? Oh, and Russell Westbrook, let's do him. There we go, for assist and steals. So we got Russ down. All right, so... I did pet it. Let me do like Jerry Lucas. There we go. Um, for rebounds. What about Dave Cohen's? No, nothing. Damn. Uh, Spurs. What about Artis Gilmore for rebounds or blocks? Okay, nothing. All right, <laughs> Ginobili for steals. No, man, he was not there for anything. What about like I don't think there's any Abdur Rahim. I don't really think there's any other Grizzlies Rockets. Oh, let's do Clyde Drexler. Um, let's do Charles Barkley. There we go. We got uh, Drexler for skills and Barkley in rebounds. Remember Maurice Cheeks. Is he on any of these? Yep, he is on assist and steals. There we go. That would have been pretty bad if I didn't get him. Minnesota. I don't know if Wally Serbiak would have been on three pointers, and I can never spell his name or his last name right. So I'm just going to copy and paste it and throw him over. I don't think Sam Cassell will be there. He's not there. What about Vladi? Now, what about Chris Weber? Nope. Uh, what about Sam Cassell? Okay, now Thunder. I don't know if Ibaka would be there for blocks. He is. Let's go. 1759 is the last spot there. Reggie Miller, three point field goals. Almost didn't get him. And we get Andre Miller for assists. There we go. That was actually kind of a big one. Um, let's do Alex English. Top score, top uh, 25 score ever. What about any of the Toms? Well, they would have came up for Clay. All right, well, I'm glad I got him. I'm glad I got Andre Miller. That one would have kind of hurt if I didn't get him. Uh, Blazers, I don't know. Would McCollum be there for three point field goals? No. He's not there. There's gonna be some modern day guys for three point field goals, but I can't, I can't. Oh, Danny Green. Well, I already typed in Draymond Green. I, like honestly, Danny Green could be there, which is kind of crazy. KD's there. Uh, what about like Mark Aguirre? Is he on any of these? No. Uh, Michael Finley? No. Jason Terry. There we go. He should be there. Three point field goals and games. I'm just missing somebody 14, 24. I mean, I said Jordan. I mean, I could just try to go some of the best players ever. And I know I'm probably forgetting some guys. I said Kawhi, but I don't think Kawhi would be in there for anything. Um, Thunder, Warriors. I'm just trying to think of like the... T oh, Larry Bird. <laughs> Didn't type his name. He's at least there for free throw percentage. Uh, anybody else? I only got six minutes left to do 62 names. So this is pretty tough. Like one of the better rebounders ever. Um, I said Gilmore. Uh, Thorpe. No. Shaq. I said Russell. I said Michael Jordan. Um... I'm just trying to think for rebounds. I said Carmelo. 
Um, so Moses Malone would have came up. Elvis Hayes, there we go. Or Elvin Hayes. Um, all right, for points, rebounds, games, and blocks. That was huge there. Or did he come up in blocks? Yeah, towards the bottom. All right, one of the better Clippers uh, or Buffalo Braves ever, you could say. 14-24 games. That's a lot. Who's played 20 years in the NBA? I don't know. That's really tough. Uh, I'm trying to think. I don't know. I wish it was like a year maybe they retired, year they started. That would have been nice. Like what draft class they were in. Could have been some nice hint. I don't know for free throw percentage. Like one of the better free throw shooters of all time. Don't know if like Stephon Marbury. I don't know. I'm just kind of being desperate at this point. We got Steve Francis now. Um, any Nets? I said kid. Devin Harris? No. Because uh, I just typed in the last name Harris. Joel and Bean on anything? No. Um, Gobert for blocks? Yeah, no, no. Probably not even close. I'm trying to think. Who was like 2009? Oh, Blake Griffin? No, he's not on anything. What about Marcus Aldridge? No. Yo, those are solid guesses. Al Horford? No. All right. Uh, I'm struggling here. Wade Bosch, Mellow. I always forget. Like, Iverson on anything? There he is. He's on steals. I said Iverson. I probably am not going through teams like good enough history, honestly. Like, Jalen Rose on anything? No. Uh, Chicago. What about, oh, Scottie Pippen. <laughs> Let me type his name. At least he's up there for steals. Dennis Rodman for rebounds. Yep, there we go. Uh, towards the bottom, but hey, is still there. Bernard King? No, no Bernard King. Uh, Wills Reed? No. Damn. Uh, I'm trying to think of Timberwolves, Spurs, Mavericks? Legends, no Rockets legends. I can't think of any Rockets specifically. Drexler, Barkley, Elijah. Not Rockets legends, uh, but they always played for them. Seattle is always tough. Oh, what about the big O? Oscar Robertson. Didn't type his name in yet. Um, there we go. So we get him for points, assists, and steals. Who was right between Steve Nash and Magic Johnson? Was Avery Johnson there? No. Oh, God. I said, I'm surprised Mike Conley was maybe not there. Lowry was there. Is Iguodala on anything? Oh, he is. Let's go. He's there for steals. Is Richard Jefferson there? He played long in the NBA. No. What about Kevin Love? No. Channing Fry? No. Ah, damn. Three-point field goes too. I'm probably missing somebody really good. Like Steph, Allen, Harden, Miller. Damn. Shane Battier there? No. I'm trying to think of like a really good three-point shooter. Free throw percentage is so tough. Like, I feel like it's just got to be a lot of guards. But I mean, Kevin Durant and Dirk are both on those um on that list so i don't think there's any like kings i don't think the marcus cousins would be on anything uh, i said divots mitch richmond i mean i don't think doug christie would have any counting stats damn um is there another celtic i said have check said mikhail said bird ainge kg pierce allen i don't think i typed in jefferson i don't know if Al jefferson would have got anything kemba walker for three pointers no he's not there Man, what teams am I forgetting? Pistons, Cavs, Mark Price on assists. There, oh, he's on free throw percentage. Okay, something to Steve Kerr. No, I don't know if you mean anything. What about uh, Paxson? <laughs> no. Uh, damn, three point field goals. Damn, that's gonna hurt. And then right after Steve Nash for assists, like that's one of the better point guards ever. And I can't think of that, or at least one of the better passers. I said Paul Kidd, Nash, Curry, Magic Johnson. Isaiah Thomas, God damn, Gary Payton, Russell Westbrook, Oscar Robertson. Who is that high in assists? I said Stockton. The, uh, what was it? Scott Skiles says like the all-time game record. Oh, he's there for at least free throw percentage. <laughs> I mean, that wasn't a bad way to look at it. Uh, Richard Lewis, yes, for three-point field goals. Uh, JJ Redick, let me do him. There we go. He was at least there for free throw percentage and three-point field goals. 154. Uh, who's also second all-time in blocks? Oh, Mutombo. <laughs> um... Mutombo. Spelling it wrong. There we go. Second on time in blocks. And it's also top 10 in rebounds. What about Bull? Um, Manute Bull. There we go. What about um, Wes Unseld? Is he on anything? Yes, he is for rebounds. All right. We got some couple names there down the stretch. I only got a minute left, though. Yeah, not a lot of bullets. Not a lot of great bullets, or at least wizards. Like if I typed in Gilbert Arenas, Antoine Jameson played a long time in the league. Antonio McDice? No, probably not. Al Harrington had a weird career. No. Uh, Zach Randolph? Any counting stats? I don't know, like, three-point shooters. Oh, Corver. There we go. Oh, my God. Thank God. Okay, Corver was there. Uh, number five in three-point field goals. I, I kind of want to get the assists and, like, the games played. Who's that? Uh, is it? Is it, like, a Jazz? Like, I typed in Dantley, right? 
Um, Stockton, Malone, Yardley, did I type in? Yeah, uh, yeah, Yardley, George Yardley. Uh, is it a piston? I don't know. Uh, what about one of the Wallaces? There we go, Ben Wallace or Blocks. Okay, almost <laughs> didn't get that. That would have been pretty embarrassing. And I only got 18 seconds left. Don't know if there's a Laker in there. I could, oh God, man, who played? Who played with M Magic Johnson? I don't remember. Oh my God, the assist is gonna hurt. I said Tony Parker. I don't want to know. I said Rondo. I don't really want to know who it is. All right, and let's see who we got here. Oh, Mark Jackson. Okay. Um, I don't hate myself for that one. I don't hate myself for Rod Strickland, Lenny Wilkins, Bob Cousy. I should have typed in Guy Rogers and Muggsy Bogues. Uh, Kevin Willis for games. I'm not gonna hate on myself for that one. Jamal Crawford, Mark Jackson would have did well. Dominique. How did I not get Dominique? I didn't also get Julius Irving, but I don't think because like him spending time in the ABA would have came up. Oakley, Paul Silas, Kevin Willis, Nate Thurman, Walt Bellamy, Chauncey Billups, Rick Barry, Calvin. Oh man, how did I not have been Rick Barry or McAdoo at least? Chauncey Billups, Eric Gordon, Jerry Smith, Wesley, Mas Wesley Matthews, Jamal Crawford, Bill Sharman, Chris Middleton. <laughs> I was not guessing him. Jeff Hornacek, Gallo, Boykins, Trey Young is there, and Terrell Brandon. You had, uh, I guess, I don't know if that's Ron Artest. I don't. I don't know, honestly. Uh, Ron Harper, Derek Harper, Mookie Blaylock, and then you had Marcus Camby, Tree Rollins, Larry Nance, The Irrelevant, Elton Brand. The ones that hurt the most is definitely Dominique Wilkins, Jamal Crawford. I think I should have got Mark Jackson, that, so that one hurts a little bit. And like Jared Smith, Eric Gordon. I, I would have liked to get one of those names, at least for three-point field goals, because they're more modern-day guys. And then looking at kind of the quiz stats here, the most impressive name we got was Scott Skiles, and I thought he was going to be there for maybe assist, but we got him for free throw percentage. And I assume Dominique Wilkins is probably going to be the most obvious name. No, it was Trey Young. Is there another Young all time that people thought that could be? I'm not sure. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. 81%, not bad when the average score was 58%, so I guess I'll take that. Like I said, if you guys do enjoy these, feel free to drop a thumbs up. And if you guys want to see these kind of weekly on the channel still. And yeah, let me know in the comments if you took the quiz yourself. Love you guys. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.